Well, the search for answers still in its early hours tonight in Amherst. Three people ages 18, 19 and 20 passed away after police say their car went off the road and overturned. My co-anchor Leah Lando has spent much of the day in Amherst. She spoke to police earlier today, now joins us live. Leah, police still have not released a cause here. Yeah, that's right, Jeff. Just a heartbreaking information to pass along. Still a lot of unanswered questions, as you mentioned, as to what led to this deadly rollover crash. It happened right behind me. This is in Amherst near Millersport Highway. Two teenagers were killed and a 20-year-old as well. And we're told two other teens, including the driver, are in the hospital. This was the scene near Audubon Parkway and Millersport Highway in Amherst early Tuesday morning, just hours after police first responded to the deadly crash that killed three people and injured two others. Captain Kevin Brown of the Amherst Police Department says it is still unclear what caused this crash. Preliminary indications that the speed may have been a factor, but there's still some more work we need to do to kind of figure out for sure. Police are also investigating whether drugs or alcohol were involved. We don't have any charges as of right now. It's all part of the uh, of our investigation, the things we're certainly looking into. Investigators say when they arrived at the scene, the three people who died in the crash were found outside the car. They are an 18 and 20 year old man and a 19 year old woman. When our officers arrived on location, they did find the vehicle that was um, overturned on its roof off the roadway and then the, uh, the the five victims who were there. There was a pretty wide debris field across the road. The driver of the 2018 Dodge sedan, an 18 year old woman, is in the hospital at ECMC along with the front seat passenger, a 17 year old boy. It doesn't appear like they're going to be life threatening injuries. Captain Brown says the victims are from Cheektowaga and Buffalo. It didn't hit an object, uh, didn't hit another vehicle, uh, left the roadway and, and while leaving the roadway, that's what caused it to overturn. And we want to offer our sincerest condolences to all the loved ones of those victims. This happened right near UB, so a lot of people were wondering, were they students at UB? Well, police say no. They say only one of the five victims in the car is actually uh, was actually a student. And they also say that they are looking for more information. So if you were in this area around 11 o'clock last night, that's when they say the crash happened. And perhaps you have some video or some information about what might have led up to this? They're asking you to please contact police. We're live in Amherst tonight. Leah Lando, 7 News.